In this first video, I'll show you how to solve a separable equation. So our first order differential equation is 1 plus y times y prime, or dy dx, equals x, and y of 0 equals 0. So it's an initial value problem. So um, for an equation that's separable, it means we're able to treat dy dx like a fraction and put all the y's on one side of the equation and all the x's on the other. So here we can multiply by dx and we can write 1 plus y dy equal to x dx. And now we've separated the variables, so all the y's are on one side of the equation, all the x's are on the other side. Then we can go ahead and we can integrate. So we integrate both sides of this equation. And we integrate from x, the starting value of x, we start at x equals 0, up to x. So now x is the independent variable in the top of the integral here. And then y at the lower limit of x is y of 0, which is 0. So this 0 is the value of y at x equals 0, up to y. So we're looking for y as a function of x. OK, so now uh, we can integrate both sides. So the integral of 1 plus y is y plus 1 half y squared. And we evaluate that between 0 and y. And the integral of x is 1 half x squared. And we evaluate that between 0 and x. OK. So the uh, lower limit here is 0. And the lower limit on the right-hand side is also 0. So um, we can just put in the upper limits here. And if you notice, what we're going to get is a quadratic equation in y. We want to solve this equation for y. And this is a quadratic equation in y. So let's put all the terms on one side of the equation, the left side of the equation. And we might as well multiply by 2. So we will have a uh, y squared. And we multiply by 2. So we have y squared plus 2y. And we pull the my, uh, 1 half x squared to the left side and multiply by 2. So minus x squared equals 0. So what we have here now is a um, quadratic equation in uh, y, which we can uh, solve using the quadratic formula. So we have um, two solutions of the uh, quadratic equation. So we have y plus or minus as the two solutions. So we can do negative b, negative 2, plus or minus the square root of b squared, 4, minus 4ac. c here is uh, minus x squared. So minus 4. Uh, 1 times 1 times minus x squared, so plus 4x squared, all divided by 2a, all divided by 2. <coughs> and then we can factor out the 4 here, take the square root to get 2. So we have minus 1 plus or minus the 2 cancels, and we have the square root of 1 plus x squared. OK? So those are the um, two roots of the uh, quadratic equation. Uh, we don't have two solutions, though. We should only have one solution. The solution of the differential equation and the initial condition should be unique. Um, so what's going on here is that both solutions cannot satisfy this single initial condition. So we have y of 0 equal to 0. So we need to satisfy that. So let's look at the value of y of 0. So y plus or minus at 0 is equal to, there's a plus, the plus 1 is minus 1 plus 
the square root of 1 plus 0 minus 1 plus 1, so the plus root will be a 0, and the minus root is minus 1 minus the square root of 1, minus 1 minus 1 is going to be a minus 2. So y of 0 is supposed to be equal to 0, so only the plus root satisfies the initial condition. So that tells us our solution is the plus 1. So our solution then is the, um, is the plus root here, the plus 1, y plus. So it's minus 1 plus square root of 1 plus x squared.